the young man is the only college student in our village studying mechanical automation. During the summer vacation, he returned home and saw how hard his father worked to support his education. This sparked an idea in him, and he decided to use the money he earned from part-time jobs at school to buy some materials. Planning to make an electric four-wheeled cargo cart for my father so that he won't have to work so hard. However, when my mother found out, she reprimanded the young man saying, Considering the circumstances at home, you still haven't learned how to conserve a bit. The young man, despite his mother's objections, steadfastly persisted in completing the creation when the final product emerged. The old father was full of amazement when he saw it. The electric cargo vehicle is equipped with a 48-volt, 2-kilowatt battery and can reach speeds of up to 80 kilometers per hour. The full load can hit 600 pounds. The father praised his son for being sensible, saying his college education was worth it, and eagerly hopped on the vehicle for a few spins. At this moment, you can see the young man busily assembling and welding square tubes to create a rectangular frame. And this is the chassis component of the vehicle. After finishing the welding process, the young man will carefully align it with the four wheels at the base and firmly secure it in position. In this manner, the car will be able to move freely. Subsequently, locate a collection of aged bicycle sprockets along with chains and ensure they are cleaned meticulously. Subsequently, connect the chain in order to achieve the desired length. Nevertheless, directly installing the chain ring at this point will not work effectively. So, it needs to be modified a bit. The welding is adjusted according to the measured dimensions on site. Don't be fooled by how smoothly the young man operates. It may seem simple. In reality, it is not quite that simple. It necessitates patience and meticulous attention to detail, along with a strong foundation of professional knowledge and practical skills. If any error is made during the process, the parts produced will become unusable. Naturally, the young man is the top student in the entire school. As a result, this particular task does not present any substantial difficulty for him. Following that, he proceeds to install the adjusted chain ring onto the four wheels, attaches a chain around it, and welds the steering gear axle firmly into position, ultimately achieving this final outcome. Proceed with welding several square tube brackets to enhance the structure's solidity and sturdiness. After applying a layer of automotive paint, the vehicle appears significantly more attractive. Subsequently, take a piece of iron plate that has holes and install it in alignment with the steering rod. After carefully nailing along the edges to fasten it, first fix a point in the center, then install and secure the seat and armrest together. Such dual adjustable seating is rare. Next, we install the braking system and all necessary wiring, which is fairly simple. I won't go into too much detail, as I'm sure those who are handy will understand just by looking. After installing the battery and controller wiring, the rear cargo area is fitted with three panels that can be freely opened and closed, making the transportation of goods more convenient and secure. Ultimately, the young man was eager to conduct a test. You can observe that when the throttle is twisted, the wheels rotate swiftly and the braking system is highly responsive. Maneuvering the vehicle forward and backward is also quite convenient. And if you wish to turn around, you simply need to adjust the orientation of the swivel seat. How is it? Doesn't it feel very convenient? When driving on a regular flat road, its speed is quite fast and it turns smoothly. Even when fully loaded, it handles effortlessly. The old father was very satisfied after seeing the finished product and couldn't help but admire the young man's exquisite craftsmanship and brilliant creativity. So, for this electric four-wheel cargo cart, if the full score is 100, how many points would you give it? Feel free to comment and leave a message.